We are here with head coach Jane LaRivier of the Washington State rowing team. Jane, can you tell us a little bit about uh, the Clemson invite last weekend? Sure. Um, <laughs> uh, we had every sort of weather that was known. Like we had tornado warnings and thunderstorms and high winds and rain that came down in buckets. In fact, on Friday they had um, close to two inches of rain. So on Saturday, we also had to deal with some flooding of the course, and uh, it was a tiny bit um, reminiscent of earlier in the spring when we would have lots of logs and debris and whatnot floating down because of the spring runoff. Um, so, you know, there's 21 disappointed teams. No racing really occurred. I mean, we had a little bit of racing, but they declared it unfair because the lanes were really out of whack because of the dam being open and the currents and different, um, the, the way the water was flowing, it affected the lanes differently. But with that said, you know, like it was a, definitely a character building weekend and the team got ready probably four times to race and we would get really close to launching and then something would happen. And uh, I think everybody kept their heads on straight and their spirits were high. And um, the one time that they did, the varsity got to run down the course, they had a great, like they felt like they had a really good uh, piece and even though it didn't count we were able to practice so it was a uh, you know practice the race which is it's helpful you know so yeah that's about it absolutely and with the season wrapping up how are you guys preparing for the last regular season regatta against Gonzaga well because of the um, missed race opportunities in Clemson you know this is it's very important because it'll we're, we're really uh, working hard now to get the right people in the right seats, make sure that we have all of the personnel in the 1V, the 2V, the 4, the 3rd um, Varsity 8. Uh, Brandon's working hard getting the novices situated because obviously you want to take a run down the course in a comp um, competitive situation before Pac-12s. So I think that's what makes it um, important. It's, it's an internal importance. You know, like we just want to make sure that we uh, take every opportunity to execute our plan in a comp competitive environment before we have to do it when it counts. Absolutely. Yeah. And then overall, how has the season been? Well, the team has been fantastic. I mean, it is, it's been something, you know, like there's weather, I think all over the United States, a lot of different uh, rowing programs have had many many different challenges and I'd, I'd, ha I'd hazard a guess that we've all including you know lots of my peer coaches at the different institutions it's been a wild weather year it's been a wild year for unusual things happening and um, you know it's just it's just one of those years and and uh, they're not all like this but uh, you know at the end of the day I think I'm really proud of our team, you know, they've trained really hard in some challenging situations, like being off the water for a little while and, um, you know, not maybe getting to practice our races as much as we would like to. But, um, you know, we they, they come in to practice in the morning and they're energized and, like, getting along really well and having fun and, you know, all the things that you can hope for going, you know, as we zero in on the championship. Absolutely. And this last home regatta means it's the seniors' last home regatta. What um, kind of message do you have for our fans? Tell them to come out. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, we, we've got, uh, I think, 10 or 12 uh, uh, seniors graduating and uh, led by Paige Danielson, who is uh, in the varsity. She's the only senior in the varsity eight right now. Oh, besides Hannah Wells Becker, the coxswain. Um, you know, and then we have all of our other seniors that will be uh, racing at home for the last time but um, you know obviously we have pack 12s in three weeks and um, but it'd be nice to have some support and we will get uh, race times and days out as soon as possible like at this point we're still scheduled for probably a little bit earlier on Saturday but there is an outside chance that we move it to Sunday based on what the wind is doing Absolutely. all right well thank you Jane all right thanks go Cougs